Hello friends. Friends, today I will narrate the story of pressure, force and area. Okay. So with the help of this story, we will understand the concept of pressure. I have already discussed the concept of force. Okay. So let us start with the story. A long time ago, long time ago, there were two friends. There were two friends. Force and area force and area these were two friends okay so one day these two friends were discussing with each other that okay area force told area that if i will remain same f if i will remain same f okay and um, if you will change a will there be any effect on the force applied on certain object then area told the force then area told the force let us take the example let us take the example of a hammer and nail area told the force that if you will apply the force f and if you will try to insert the nail, insert the nail in a wall with this end inside the wall, what will happen? What will happen? Force told to area that, that uh, I suppose there will be more force applied on it, then there will be more effort from my side. Nail told that, no, I am saying the force remains F and if now you will try to insert from this end inside the wall, then what will happen? Here the area is less, here the area is more, here the area is A1 and here the area is A2 and A1 area is more than a2 a1 in is more than a2 then where it is easier to insert the nail inside the wall from which side force uh, told after certain thinking after some time that i suppose from this side it is easier so then force told to area then then area then area told to force Right, my dear friend, the effort by you in both the cases is same, that is F. But the area in both the cases is different. In the first case, the area is A1 and in the second case, the area is A2. Now, this force by area is known as pressure. The force by area is known as pressure okay so more the area lesser will be pressure with the same force more the area lesser will be pressure with the same force so in the first case it is difficult to insert this cap end in the second case lesser the area therefore more the force more the pressure more the pressure with the same force with the same force okay because these are inversely proportional to each other so it will be easier to insert the nail from this end compared to this end i repeat this third friend of ours is known as pressure this third friend of ours is known as pressure and pressure is equals to force divided by area if there will be more area same force then pressure will be lesser applied so it will be difficult to work it will be difficult to get the work done okay like in this case in this case the pressure is force by area here the area is lesser so pressure will be 
more for the same force for the same force okay so in this case in this case it is easier to insert the nail from this pointed end inside the wall otherwise you have to apply you have to apply more force you have to apply more force more force means more pressure to insert from this end but fruitful is to insert this pointed end i hope you have understood the concept of our third friend that is pressure let us take another example do you know the school going kids take bag they take bag the school going children they take bag the these strips these strips are made broader than thin these strips are made broader than thin because broader strips means pressure equals to force by area okay the child is applying the same force okay while carrying the bag the broader area means lesser pressure he or she has to apply it to carry this bag similarly there are so many examples there are so many examples of pressure and force like there is one another example we use knife we use knife which end we use knife the sharp end to cut the vegetables to cut the food because the sharp end has lesser area so lesser area means more pressure more pressure if force is same okay so pressure equals to force divided by area and force unit is newton and area is meter square so units are newton per meter square so this is the story of force pressure and area i hope you have understood and enjoyed the story thank you thanks a lot